Hey, what is going on YouTube? It is Lance OA, and I just wanted to alert you guys to a new release at Atmax. It is the 2017 Republic of Ghana 1 ounce Silver African Leopard in BU fashion. So, let's check out the uh, the reverse first. You've got this uh, crouching African Leopard, and it does look like it's ready to pounce on some prey. Um, it's got African Letter, the uh, base of the coin. And then you can see some of the grass here kind of intermingles with the text, uh, with the 999 silver text. So uh, maybe that's one mark against it. Uh, as far as the coin design goes, uh, it looks like they've got maybe some varying finishes, maybe a frosted on the leopard, and maybe that uh, that kind of uh, shiny, shiny, glossy finish back in the in the field. So looks like they've done real well on as far as getting the dimension right on a uh, on the relief of the coin looks like they've got the body of the leopard in pretty good scale I do recall a uh, a Canadian wildlife release the cougar and let me I'll pull this thing up and this just looks crazy hideous I mean you got like t-rex feet here I know this thing's supposed to be like in motion but it's just not well done. I mean, this thing looks hideous. Look at this kid thing's mouth. Is that like... <laughs> I don't know. Whoever drew this one up, I, I'm i sorry. It, it's it's bad work. <laughs> this does look a lot better. Uh, they are quoting a mintage of 50,000 units. So uh, let me know in the comments below if you think that is kind of appealing. It is a Scottsdale manufactured uh, coin. So that's cool. Um, Scottsdale has some really nice stuff they're putting out. Uh, so the quality is quite high on there. Uh, as far as the uh, the obverse goes, you got uh, Elizabeth II, 2017. Uh, 100 Sedis. Sedis, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but Republic of Ghana. So it does have some face value. Um, and right off the bat, it's got the, the leopard print as the field um, finish so I'm not sure if that is a positive or a negative maybe it's gonna hide milk spots um, it seemed pretty wavy and distracting I wish they wouldn't have done it uh, around the um, the text bar in the outer rim if they would have kept that kind of just shiny it might have let allowed the the text to pop out a little bit and then uh, as far as a hundred set is go I, I went to the currency converter and I found out uh, if I typed in 100 Ghanaian sedis, it was $22.94 US. That is pretty crazy. I, so I'm hoping, is that right? Am I right on that? Because, I mean, if you're buying, if you're on your way to Ghana, buy some of these, you know, e either it's a game winner or you get your money back because that's pretty much what the coin is going for, $22.89 uh, cash uh, check value uh, on Atmex. Um, other notable things, if you buy five, it does come sealed in a, uh, in a plastic bar here. And then I think uh, they said something about uh, 240 come in a larger box. So uh, let me know if you guys are interested in this one. I'm probably going to stare clear for the most part. I might pick up one just to check it out. Um, but I'm not really, uh, I'm not sure on this one. It would have been cool. It This is quoted as the first in the series. It would have been cool if they started with a lower number and built up. Uh, I think that has some, uh, maybe um, a little bit going for it when, uh, when they start with a really low mintage and then they work their way up, uh, I think that really helps the series um, and carries the value over. Like with the um, Rwanda coins, the Rwanda wildlifes, they started with like I think a thousand units um, for some of their first releases like the Silverback Gorilla might have been a thousand um, released and maybe the Elephant, Rwanda Elephant might have had a, a thousand or so. I know they, they bumped their way up and they worked at uh, 5000 for the Rhino and then 10000 for the Cheetah. So, you know, those earlier coins were extremely valuable um, to have as far as uh, if someone who's collecting the set. 
So check it out. You got the leopard. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching. This is Lance Away. See you guys in the next one.